This here is red iron oxide and aluminum powder. Um, it's pretty fine aluminum powder. Um, this here is going to be my thermite mixture, just in case uh, some of you didn't know. Uh, thermite it burns very, very hot. They use it to, uh, usually for welding train tracks and stuff, but uh, this here you can get a pound of thermite mixture uh, for about seven dollars on pyro creations so uh, there's not really uh, use for it that you can do such as like rockets or anything um, the only thing you could really do with it is just watch it burn um, it leaves behind a molten iron like a slag and that's pretty much it uh, but it's still pretty fun to watch especially because it heats up so much um, incendiary rounds use thermite or, or type of thermite mixture and it makes it nice and hot so it just turns to a brown mixture um, the thermite mixture is 50 50 so i did one huge scoop of aluminum and then one huge scoop of iron oxide i ended up doing four and a half scoops of each and that made this so uh the one thing i did want to mention was that when i ordered it off of pyro creations they sent me a decent amount of aluminum, but a lot more red iron oxide. As you can see, this thing here is, is a lot. So a red iron oxide you can use as a catalyst in a sugar rockets, stuff like that. So I'm going to save that red iron oxide. But uh, if not, I may try to mix it with some uh, magnalium or something and see how well it works for that. But anyways, this is all for now. Stay tuned to the next video. Um, so thermite isn't supposed to just ignite with a torch. So I'm gonna test that. And if it doesn't light, then that's good. I uh, should be using a magnesium strip or a sparkler. Go back. There you go. You see, shouldn't ignite. And as you can see, it doesn't. It just blows. It's the aluminum. So that's good. Thermite a good thermite reaction. Let's go ahead and get this guy out. Oh, I can see it. But this stuff remains hot for a while. You can see it's in a molten state. That right there is very hot. If you take a normal lighter to this, it wouldn't even light that fast. Even if I use the torch, very hot. It starts to smoke, you'll see. See that? This is very, very hot and it's just iron. When it melts that metal, it makes a reaction. It's still very hot even though it's cooling off.